What's going on everyone? Jake and Jacob here for another anniversary trailer reaction. This time we got a good one that I'm so excited to talk about. <laughs> we are doing Underworld, the 15th anniversary of Underworld, the Kate Beckinsale vampire werewolf uh, film franchise. Uh, the original movie came back out in 2003 and we are going to be reacting to its Can't trailer. I believe it's that old, man. Dude, it's it. I remember watching this movie and actually loving this with my dad. We enjoyed these movies, especially the first two, because they were with, they were following her, yeah. and then it kind of spun off from there. Um, I personally love these movies because one, I really enjoyed them when I was a young kid, but two, I have an infatuation with Kate Beckinsale. Yes, she is in my mind one of the most <laughs> underrated actresses ever to to be in film, and so I'm very much looking forward to seeing the original trailer because I've never seen it before, um, and seeing what kind of stuff it reveals. I don't know, I, I've actually never talked to you about this, but how do you feel about Underworld? Um, I'm a fan of especially the first one. I, I do like some of the movies. Later, I didn't like the later ones, Yeah, honestly. they kind of went all haywire, they, yeah. They were kind of crazy, but mm -hmm. um, this first one, I definitely appreciate it. Especially, if you think about it, you know, nowadays they're talking about fem strong female leads and strong female she action characters. Them. And like this and Resident Evil were going on yep. at this time, and we had these type of characters in film back then, and... You know, they should get some credit for doing it. Not, it's the, just because they're know. not comic booky. Exactly. They're yeah. not in the mainstream. So, honestly, back then, this kind of stuff was hot. The, you know, the vampire stuff. So, Dude, there were vampire movies everywhere. Oh, yeah. And this, honestly, as far as action went, this is one of the better ones. Yeah, it's sure. really cool. Yeah. It's super dark. It has that, you know, darker tone to it. Uh, so let's yeah. go ahead and check out the trailer. I don't really remember the trailer, though. So I've I don't know if I've ever seen yeah. it. So, yeah, it's going to be very interesting. Yeah. Oh, the perch. Funny how you know the mythology and everything. I have Celine. no idea what's going on. Celine, she's such a badass. One by one. They are the immortal. Ooh, they got the voice voice over. Over. Nice. <laughs> Lusting for power and wealth. The chain has never been broken. Not in 14 centuries. Another driven by revenge. Soon we'll defeat the vampires on their own ground. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's a versus werewolves. Right? Yeah, it's a war. It's oh, vampires nice. versus werewolves. Yeah, but they call them they call them lichens. Yeah, I forgot oh, about that. Lichens, honestly, yeah. Scott Speedman. This movie is the king of slow motion. <laughs> the king. He totally has an early two thousand feel yeah. to it. There you go. <laughs> He's a hybrid. Greater than vengeance. You'll be lucky if I can convince the cousin to spare your life. Absolution will be yours the moment you kill Michael. <laughs> Feel a lot. Yeah, it seems like it is. Yeah, I noticed these older trailers show a lot. Yes, very much. But we weren't paying attention as much back then. Yeah, look at the <laughs> look graphics. Look For at back the graphics. Then they look good. Yeah, they really do. You can definitely tell it's dated though. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. But just imagine back then. Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh, oh that's, so that's sick. sick. That's sick. Underworld. Oh, I was I was gonna mention that. <laughs> that is the best shot in the entire movie when she finally kills the, the bad guy oh, and yeah. cuts his face in half this way and his face just slides they show down. it? They show oh, it. Oh, wow. It's That's crazy. Awesome, but... Are those movies rated R? Uh, I, they gotta be. There's a lot of yeah? blood. Okay. I would have to go back and look. I'm not sure, but they do show a lot. What I... It does show a bunch. You can definitely tell it's yeah. a 2003 trailer. <laughs> um, when I see those graphics that popped up about when the battle begins and whatnot, if the first thing I thought of was Sam Raimi, Raimi's Spider-Man franchise. Oh, really? Because it had the same style okay. of graphics going on, and it's the same era. So um, the biggest thing I like about this in comparison to other vampire werewolves movies is how different the werewolves look in yeah. comparison to other uh, I, other movies. They're not as hairy. They're not all covered in hair. They I think that's why they call like them lichens. Muscular yeah. and more humanoid-like mm -hmm. yes. rather than beasts, you know? 
Yeah, it's pretty. It seems pretty cool. I want to go back and rewatch it because I didn't. I don't even remember them being like their love story Loved. and like the um. So the guy is a lichen and a vampire. Or a yeah. So and a he human? he has this he has this bloodline, uh, like this rich bloodline in I think it's a lichen, and they're trying to find him. Okay. He's like the centerpiece. Yeah. And they're trying to unlock this power of his, and then he ends up getting. I believe it's vampire blood in him, or he has to drink vampire oh, blood. Wow. And it does this combination. That's why he, he was like all black. That's kind of cool. Because yeah. he was like, uh, that was his full transformation. He was like going into a lichen, but he stopped because he was half vampire, half lichen. So he had this like weird look over him with black eyes and he was super strong and all this stuff. But yeah. it was, it was pretty badass. Yeah, pretty no, badass. I, she is badass. Kate Beckinsale is awesome. She's the best, awesome. man. She makes these movies. I mean, as, as a young boy, it's the reason why I went to go see these movies was because of her. And she looks great. I mean, I wish she was... In more movies these days. Well, honestly. I think she fell into. We talk about this a lot these days, but she fell into a franchise that just gave her a bad rap. No, that's because the true. movies were so bad. They are critically. They're not slammed, but they just aren't critically favored. Yeah, exactly. By a number, yeah. And she may have fell into fallen into this trap with it. Oh, she's that type of actress. Exactly. But yeah. she's done so many great roles. Oh yeah, and she's, she's done other lost. stuff like, too. Yeah. She's never been in so many like. It's just a bummer that she didn't go far because she's so talented in what she does. So yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if they reboot this one day or make a TV show or something like that. I, I think I actually think there is a TV show in the works. Really? I, you know what the yeah. best part of this is, other than Kate Beckinsale, is the mythology. I think it's pretty yes. cool. It has a unique spin. Well, as in the, to other the vampire third stuff. movie yeah. went back to the original when vampires had lichens as slaves and then the lichens broke out and oh, that's wow. when the feud started. She was in that, right? Kate Beckinsale oh, wasn't. she wasn't? No, yeah. the, the okay. guy that she kills at the end of this was in it. Mm. And and uh, Michael Sheen's character, who's the bad guy in this one, was also in it. He was oh, the first cool. the first uh, lichen who broke out and was a bad guy and like all this type of stuff. And he's like reading this, uh, doing this kind of rebellion towards the vampires and whatnot. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I'm like interested. you said, there's a huge mythology yeah. <laughs> to it, so... Yeah, uh, that is our reaction to Underworld, the 2003 vampire werewolf movie starring Kate Beckinsale and Scott Speedman. Uh, obviously, you can tell I love this movie. Um, it's gonna get the trailer's gonna get Jacob to go back and watch it. Definitely um, want to. It's been a while. Yeah, so <laughs> if you have not seen it, go check it out. Head down in the comments, let us know what you think of it and what you eventually will think of it uh, once you've seen it. Um, and as for our trailer reaction, can't thank you guys enough for joining us. Uh, head down there, comment, share, like, and of course subscribe. Hit that subscribe button here in just a few minutes. Um, for Jacob, for myself, thank you for joining us today. See you next time. Peace out.